Have you ever wanted to test out Minecraft features that are coming to the game soon, but you didn't know how? Today, my dudes, I'm going to be teaching you how to test out all the features in Minecraft Snapshots when they do release. So let's get started on today's video. So this video is going to be for Minecraft Java. We're going to go ahead and open up the Minecraft Launcher. Once you go ahead and get inside this launcher, we're going to go down to the bottom left corner. Now you're going to open up this little drop box and you're going to search for the latest snapshot. Right here is the latest snapshot. If you can't find this by chance, you can always go into installations up here. Go to new installation and go and find latest snapshot right here and go ahead and create it down in the right corner. And then now you can actually go ahead and use the latest snapshot. But if you already have this little dirt block here, I think that's a dirt block. You can go ahead and click on that. Now it's not just as easy as doing this. So stick around for the rest of the video. I'm sorry I interrupt this video to just let you know, please like, comment and subscribe. I love you. Thank you. Goodbye. So we went ahead and opened up Minecraft and you can tell we're in the latest release candidate snapshot down in the left corner there. You can see that. We go ahead, go to single player, we go to create new world. Now this is where you want to pay attention is we go to the more section in the top right here. We go to data packs. Now the data packs, as you can see in the available section are going to be data packs that are available through Minecraft, or you can throw your own data packs in there. But we're going to look for the update 1.21 features. If you do not add this in, you are not going to be able to use things that are coming to 1.21, like the crafter and other items as well. And as you can see, there's a bundle pack here as well. The uh, You can go and use that. And then there's the trade rebalance and updated trades for villagers. We don't want those, but they are there. So you want to make sure this is in your selected. We go ahead and proceed. Create the new world. Now, if we turn on creative, we can actually go ahead and we can locate things like the trial ruins, so we can do structure, trial ruins, try and chambers, sorry. And then we can locate those and we now know those are in the game. And then we can also check out the new crafter table um, and go ahead and use all those new features. So that was just a quick tutorial just to show you guys how to do this on Java Edition. If you guys are playing on Bedrock Edition and want to see how to do it, go ahead and check my channel. I'll have a video up very shortly on how to do that as well. Thank you for watching and peace out, my dudes.